happened to you guys? I just met them the second. Literally the second. Hi. Hello. Oh my gosh. This is a brother and sister duo. They just got here, I think yesterday. I don't know, maybe yesterday or today. I have to find out. Um, I think yesterday. Hi. <laughs> so this is the boy. This one's Hopper. He's a gray tabby with the white paws. Whoops. There's my phone. <laughs> and um, this is Cricket. She's also a gray tabby. She's got more white on the face than her brother. But she's also both like gray tabbies with white parkies. But she's got white on her face. And she's a lot smaller than he is. So they were actually abandoned in public housing in a, a, a town nearby. And they're about six months old. Um, we, I don't think they're spayed or neutered yet. So we will have to separate them. <laughs> because they're about six months old. But, um... I just came in today to do some other things, and I found out they were here. So this is going to be kind of just a quick, well, I'll probably just do a regular, regular length of video because they're perfectly fine. But I just, you know, I'm just a, like, it's just kind of, I usually I put them in a room and do their videos and pictures, but they are, it's a Saturday, so it's busy and the rooms are taken. So this is just kind of uh, the cat room that we have them loose in. Hi! So obviously, extremely friendly, pretty fearless. I mean, she's maybe a tad shyer than he is. Um, but, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, if you did want both special rates for adopting, but you don't, we can probably, we can probably separate them, I think it'd be okay, but, oh my god, they're so adorable, hi, so this is Cricket, I mean, this is Hopper, that's the boy, that's Cricket, that's the girl, like I said, they're about six months old, and they were abandoned, they were left behind, doesn't look like they were left behind too long, they look like they're in pretty good shape. Uh, maybe the people just moved out. Look at how pretty she is with your pink nose. She's so cute. She's so cute. Oh my god, I love them. Look, and they're just, they're just, especially him. You're just a big purr bucket, aren't you? He just says, I love to purr. Oh my god. So if you want, um, like older kittens or not, that they're out of that really crazy stage, you know, and, um, that are really friendly and social, and I think are going to just be fine, um, as soon as you bring them into your home, um, I think... You definitely have to pick one of these two. They are just amazing. I'm sure they're little lap cats. Where are you going? Are you going in your cage to have a little bite to eat? Okay, well, I'm going to wrap it up. Um, <laughs> he likes to flop over a lot. Come in, uh, apply for these. I mean, apply for these, um, these adorable kittens. Thanks for watching. Bye. Well, I was going to go and take some pictures of them, and I was using this toy to get them to look at me for the pictures, and they... <laughs> They just started playing. They just grabbed, he grabbed it out of my hand. Like he literally, it's kind of like it makes a crunchy sound. So if you want to get him, whoever adopts him, um, he needs to get him this toy. They really like it. <laughs> I just wanted to get a picture. And they're not like fighting over it. Oh my gosh. But it's like, it makes like that crinkly. It's like a crinkly toy. He loves it. He goes, we like this. We love this toy. This is ours now. Okay, bye.